What's up everybody? Today we're taking a look at Gatorade water. Gatorade has figured out once again uh, how to make more money and it's to simply put water in a bottle. Now this is a huge brand crossover. One is water, a natural resource, and the other is Gatorade, the brand that uh, is drunk by all kinds of athletes to keep them hydrated throughout a game or whatever. So what Water did one day, they showed up at Gatorade headquarters in their nice Armani suit, looking very fit, and Gatorade sat down with Water and was like, look, Water, you're easy, you just flip open the tap and you collect it in a bottle. It's cheap, you know, very, very cheap. What we want to do is bottle you up in a nice little looking water bottle that is 100% recycled plastic and sell you for about 2,000 times you're actually worth. Do we have a deal? And water was like, yeah. <laughs> and boom, here we have Gatorade water. Now, would a lot of people say, no, that's not how it went. I was there. I read on Reddit that it wasn't. That's no <laughs> fact check. Let me tell you, that's exactly how it happened. But anyways, all jokes aside, it's Gatorade water, and apparently it's unflavored, alkaline, electrolyte infused. And at the very bottom there, it says blend for taste, which has me confused, because it should say blended for taste. But I, I think it's kind of misleading to make people think, should I go and buy the extra flavored powders that you can mix in with the water? So I think it's kind of like some kind of nefarious way to market their powders to put in this unflavored water. But a lot of people are just saying on here that it's just blended for taste, but I don't know. It, it's weird. Anyways, it has a pH of 7.5 or higher. Um, whatever that means, and seven steps enhanced filtration. So this was filtered seven different times, so that lets you know it's good, right? But uh, I'm going to do something fun and different here because here we have the Gatorade water, and we also have some water I got straight out of the tap, and we're going to see which one actually tastes better. This was released February 28th, 2024. It is a very new item that you will soon be seeing on your store shelves, if not already. And it's made to uh, keep people hydrated all day without the added sodium and sugars of regular Gatorade. The chief brand officer of Gatorade said, Today's athletes are more wellness-minded than ever, and they expect Gatorade to meet all of their hydration needs 24-7. Gatorade water is an all-day hydration option for all active people, no matter who they are or how they move, from the leader in sports fuel that they know and trust. So I guess they are really patting themselves on the back saying... <laughs> <laughs> Everybody loves us, so why would they buy water from anywhere else? So, yeah, they're going to know when they buy this, they are getting actual real water. Not this stuff that comes out of the faucet. No, 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 you got to get it from the bottle and pay about $2.50. That's real authentic water. So on the official website, I'm looking at a picture of a dude walking down some stairs. He looks like he's in a rush, you know, for, uh, you know, he's got that deadline he has to meet at the office, but he's getting in some gym time in between. You know, that's how folks in the big city do things. They're always darting back and forth to the gym and to their little apartment. Coffee with Kate at 430, then back to the office to finish up some deadlines. Am I right? On the official website, what they say about Gatorade water is it brings the credibility of the bolt to unflavored enhanced water. All day hydration. Gatorade water is the latest addition to the Gatorade hydration portfolio formulated for all active people to hydrate throughout their entire day. So anyways, let's see what this actually does taste like. I hope it tastes like water. Yep, smells like nothing. So, here we go. Gatorade water. Okay, this water has kind of like a softness to it. It kind of has a, a thing saying, hey... 
Yeah, I come from a very well uh, maintained uh, household. I come from a gated community. Um, not a lot of stuff really happened in my neighborhood. Uh, I listened to Blink-182 and that made me feel like a rebel as a teenager. And uh, yeah. It does have like a softness flavor or taste to it. It's weird because I, I smell like some sort of very faint citrus uh, smell to it. Probably the electrolytes or whatever's in it, but it does have some sodium in it. So it's given uh, 30 milligrams of sodium per serving. And I think there's uh, one bottle is a serving. So there is that. I, maybe that's what I'm tasting, but yeah. I don't know. It just tastes like water. That's just soft. It's soft. So now we're going to compare it to some tap water. Here we go. I don't know. Like the tap water has more of a crisp feeling. You know, like I, I actually feel like my thirst is quenched after drinking some tap water compared to this. Mm. I tell you what, the tap water definitely hits. Let's go back to this. Yeah, this is making me feel like I, I want to drink more and more of it. It's not quenching my thirst as much as regular water is. That's surprising. I'm not like trying to be biased or trying to bash this because it just seems like a cheap... Uh, way to sell more uh, water and make more money for the company but like for real the tap water has more of a crisp flavor to it that i w would much rather have i would rate tap water a 10 out of 10 and we all know there's all the conspiracies about tap water and oh, you shouldn't drink it because of this that or the other but I mean, I was born and raised drinking out of the hose and everything else, so, like, I don't know. I'm I'm cool, I think. I turned out fine. Yeah, it, it, this tastes like fuzzy water. Just very soft, like a pillow-style water. And it isn't hitting. It's not making me feel like, ah. Uh, after a hard day of, you know, mowing the lawn or something, like, uh, come back and drink this. It's, it actually looks like there's stuff floating in it. I mean, I got lights in here, so you're able to really see in here. But, like, I am seeing floaters in here as well, which I never get out of the tap. I mean, uh, I do have a filter system in my house, but, uh, like, yeah, compared to this, this is supposed to be filtered seven times. And, uh, yeah, this is, uh, yeah, I'm seeing floaters in here. I'll take one more swig of this. Yeah, it's like, you'll drink this, and when it first hits your tongue, you're gonna be like, okay, yeah, that, that's, that's water. That's the old familiar taste of water. But then, towards the end of drinking this, you get this, like, plastic... Maybe, I don't know, taste of something that is reminiscent of what you would expect from a Gatorade, which maybe that's all the electrolytes or whatever, but it's it makes your tongue feel dry, like it dries your tongue out or something. I just feel like uh, someone has combed over my tongue and brought up all the taste buds after I drank this. Would I buy this again? Absolutely not. Would I recommend this for anybody? Absolutely not. Uh, this is total trash compared to regular tap water. So, <laughs> for those of you that will fall for uh, this, <laughs> thinking this is going to be some great stuff, it's not. Now, if you're just needing a bottle of water and this is the only thing available just to get you through whatever, fine. But, dear God, what a huge cash grab that is just so blatantly preposterous that uh, I... I 
Maybe you should just buy one and keep it sealed because I don't see this lasting too long on the market. Regular tap water though, that's going to be here for a while. I think much longer. So I think I will give Gatorade water price, taste. Did it quench my thirst? I'm sure it's going to give my body hydration. Don't get me wrong. But is it worth having this buying this no absolutely not i give this a zero out of ten just drink out of the water fountain you'll be a whole lot happier your thirst will be quenched a whole lot better and yeah you don't have to uh go through the trouble of taking this cap off and all that so anyways gatorade water zero out of ten and thank you guys for watching this cheat day review i am dj glowing eyes always wanting to remind you and it is okay to cheat every once in a while. And I will see you next time. Peace out.